Oh, holy shit, this is so scuffed. Anyways, hi, my name's Danny. Uh, if you're asking why I'm wearing gloves, it's because it's cold. Like, very cold in my room. But anyways, uh, my name's Danny, and I... This is basically a video of how I got into Tokusatsu and how it, like, how it's going so far. Uh, so basically, uh, three things you need to know me about me. One, I'm not from the United States. Two, I was very young when I got into it. And three, I never really had access to it growing up. This is very ex strange to explain, so it's probably better to start from the beginning. So basically, when I was, when I got into Tokusatsu, I basically watched two DVDs that basically got me in, all into this. That would be fucking Gridman, like a very, not even Gridman, but a very shitty Vietnamese dub of Superhuman Samurai Cyber Squad. And I think it was either subbed or just a raw, like, file of Kamen Rider Ryuki on DVD. So that's basically how I got in, all into this. It, it's just basically, hey, uh, yeah, we've uh, I just found this at a fucking DVD shop, and I just basically watched it from there. And then move, say, I think I think I was seven when Dragon Knight was airing, and this also aired on my fucking birthday of all places. Well, technically, it's aired in December for a sneak peek, but they basically showed the entire episode. But then it started like s serialization in January third of like I think two thousand nine. So yeah. Uh, it holds a very special place in my heart. So I'd watched Dragonite and then watched Decade. All in all in the same year, I believe. I don't know. I don't know how I found Decade. That's the thing. I don't know where it came from because most most people I read like how they got into it is like, oh, we watched Power Rangers and then we just went down the like where where the source material was. But that's not how I found it. I I don't even know how, but. I want to say it was like YouTube recommendations from like part one Power Rangers Megazord like com combination strips or like combination clips and then just going from there to like I, I think it was a fuck ton of like old Sentai and Rider ads. I'll fuck I'll probably put up like thumbnails over here if I find the the clips or the thumbnails for it but that's basically how I got into it and then I watched TVN, a lot of TV Nihon subs, and did not pronounce Decade properly until very later in my life. Because I kept saying Decade, because I watched Decade growing up, so I'd, I'd say that's kind of cringe, but I, I really don't know. And then, basically, un up until like two years ago, I wasn't very active in the Tokyo sphere, and I wasn't very active in Tokyo at all. Cause I, the last time I checked Tokyo news, like actively, was like out of curiosity, and that was during the time I think Ghost was being previewed on JE Fusion. Like I found an article on there, and that's all I knew about Tokyo at the time. I did not pay attention to anything, but then I found. I found Geo, and then anniversary seasons keep pulling me back for some reason. So, Geo was the first season I watched live, and then it was zero one. But now currently Saber. So, yeah, that's my fucking Tokyo life basically. It started from a very uh, curious way of watching uh, bootleg fucking DVDs and from Vietnam now to like torrenting, uh, like almost almost official subs if uh, if Toei can actually give the licenses. Uh, in the United States. So yeah. That's how I got into Tokyo. It's it's not that it's, I wouldn't say it's not that hard. It's kind of hard mode if you don't know like how to do it like if you don't know how to use the internet. But other than that, it's pretty easy to get into Tokyo nowadays because there are so many services that you can like you can watch officially from. You can watch Power Rangers on Netflix, you can watch a fucked up Ultraman on uh Tokusatsu and Super Sentai. I think there's a lot of seasons on there. And then for Ryder, uh, you're, you're shit out of luck unless you know how to pirate or sorry, torrent and use illicit means to get Con Rider. I do not condone any illegal uh, actions. This is not an endorsement of piracy. I'm just saying how most people get their shit nowadays. Toei, don't. 
Fucking hell. Toei, don't send your assassins after me. I know you will. But. Just don't. It's easy as that. Just don't. So yeah. That's how I got into Tokyo. That's how you can get into Tokyo. I'll probably leave a fuck ton of links in the description. Of like where you can watch. Officially, you can find your other illicit means from other websites. I will also be linking a guide to watching a rider. But yeah. It's not that hard. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. This is probably rambly shit. You're probably asking why I have a cap on. If you're not, uh, I have a shit haircut. And, uh... Uh, I've been I've been wearing a fucking Duolingo shirt this entire time, and my background has been a fucking picture of Kitaka saying they don't know I'm dying. If you haven't watched episode final, you, you kind of fucked with that one, dog. So yeah.